Fun and Games. Understanding school afternoon breaks in English. Hello there, learners. It's always great to see you all. Today we'll be diving into the topic of school afternoon breaks, with a specific focus on recess and playtime. We'll talk about how to describe these fun and important parts of the school day, and how to talk about the activities you or your kids might be involved in. The first thing we need to clarify is what exactly we mean when we say recess and playtime. Now, these terms are often used interchangeably. Recess is a term frequently used in American English to describe a break period at school, typically where students are free to play and relax. On the other hand, Playtime is more commonly used in British English to describe the same period. So, whether you're having a conversation with someone in New York or London, you'll know how to describe this part of the school day. When we think about recess or playtime, what are some activities that come to mind? Well, students might play games, have a snack, chat with friends, or simply relax. Some popular games include tag, hide-and-seek, or sports like soccer. To use these in a sentence, you might say, 1. During recess, I often play tag with my friends. 2. I usually have a snack and chat with my friends during playtime. These phrases will help you communicate about these daily school activities. Everyone has different feelings about recess. Some people love the chance to play and run around, while others might prefer a quiet moment to relax. Here are some phrases to help you express your feelings. 1. I look forward to recess because it's a great way to relax. 2. Playtime is my favorite part of the school day because I love playing soccer. Don't forget to practice these sentences and adjust them to your liking. And that's all for today's video. We hope you now feel more confident talking about recess and playtime in English. Don't forget, practice makes perfect. So, try to use these new terms and phrases in your daily conversations. We look forward to seeing you in our next video. Happy learning!